Using a standard size average person's golf club out of their bag, first and foremost, with it being so long, you're just not gonna generate that much power. No. Another thing is accuracy. When you're standing away from the ball as far as you are with that average size club, the less accurate you are gonna be to hit it. Damn it. How the hell did I do that? Damn it. That was bad, right? Damn it. Sucks today. We typically play pretty good golf. Today we didn't play so hot, but you know, it gives me and Jonah a chance to bond and hang out together. Have you pushed any of your work stuff out on social media? No. I'm in the car business now. I'm selling cars just like Jonah is. So the common talk that we have on Wednesdays is typically it's either about golf or it's about car sales. Just been word of mouth. Well, I haven't sold a car in 12 days, so I got to change up some strategies. The aggravating part is when you spend three hours with somebody. Oh, yeah. And they can't buy. Yeah. But then you turn around and you look across the showroom and three of your buddies are closing deals. Right. But at the end of the day, being nice to a customer that may not want to buy or may not, I mean, it doesn't bring home money. Like, you got to have that little assertiveness and being like, look. I think for the most part, my dad is open to my advice because I've heard it from, uh, from him all my life and him giving me advice. And so for it to kind of be a 180 and, you know, me take on that uh, role, it's definitely new. But, um, you know, I'm just appreciative of the fact that, you know, he's open ears and, you know, thoroughly is hearing what I have to say. It means a lot. I want to give everybody a chance and an opportunity. You ask questions and that will get you the furthest to a customer or the furthest away. In my head, I always am like, the customer can buy until they can't. And then that's when you gotta find an alternative to have them walk out with a car. I spent three, over three hours on that guy yesterday. Oh, hell no. Seven banks turned him down. That's a half day work right there. It was, I mean, at the end of the day, I missed lunch. In the last year, Jonah's come quite a ways. Um, he has uh, landed a really good job. And I'm, I'm proud to see that he is working hard. And when our kids, are sharing advice with us and giving us examples and teaching us, we're all winning. Some of the best advice he's given me is, hey, Dad, you know, once you land your customer on the car and you get them inside, um, you, you can't get too invested in your customer. And I do. I get, I get invested in people. I want to help people. I want to give people a third and fourth and fifth chance. Let's head on. Neither one of us played very good today. Get away from this terrible game of golf, even though you won. <laughs>